Hello, and welcome to the DSU Sports Update. I'm Ben Bullock, and joining me today is head volleyball coach here at DSU, Keisha Killingsworth. Coach, how are you doing today? Great, and you? Doing pretty good. Coach, with this being your first season, talk about the transition going from an assistant coach to being a head coach now. Um, I think becoming a head coach is, of course, a little bit more demanding, but it's more about developing a culture and philosophy um, that you feel comfortable with and that you feel the players will um, be able to adapt to. Um, you know, you're more responsible for that than as an assistant coach. Okay. Now, you guys haven't gotten off to the start that you probably not wanted, um, but talk about how much of your team has grown since you took over at the beginning of the season. Um, they're starting to compete, and um, I think they understand – the philosophies that I want and the type of coach that I am. Um, it's difficult for them to compete for long periods of time, but they're, they're starting to understand and work towards that. Um, and hopefully, you know, within the next couple of games, we'll start peaking. Okay. Now, speaking of those next couple of games, you guys are about to enter a tough stretch of four games on the road within conference play. Talk about how important this stretch is to your team and hopefully for the future and you guys can build off that as well. Um, this stretch is definitely important. Um, I think it will hopefully build up a sense of confidence um, and a sense of wanting to win. They want to win, but we have to push through and push past 15. Um, they, they really want to be there, and I think for the majority of the part, if they just understand that they can finish, then we'll be fine. Okay, now, Coach, you know, dealing with a young team, you're going to have some ups and some downs. And throughout the season, you've definitely seen your ups and also you've seen your downs. Talk about how your team can possibly grow off that and become a better team for the future, what you expect from them. Um, one of the things that we've talked about in um, practice is effective communication and staying consistent all the way through. Um, when we get on our runs, if we can stay consistent with that and um, play point for point, especially when we're up by five, point, five points, we'll be fine. But it's when we are down and we lose our momentum or we lose our heart and we can't finish. Okay, now let's take a trip down memory lane real quick. Um, you were a stellar player at, at the University of Florida. Uh, talk about how was it playing for such a big time school in the SEC like that on a regular basis? Um, when we came out, it was nobody out there except us. You know, it was us versus whoever was on the other side of the court. And our biggest thing was to compete and win no matter who's on the court, whether it was Mississippi State, whether it was Texas, whether it was FAMU, whoever. It was our ultimate goal was to come out and win um, by any means possible. So um, it's a little transition coming from playing at, at that level and, um, you know, wanting to come back. And I still have that heart. I still have that passion. Right. I just try to instill it into the girls and realize, okay, you're no longer a player, you're a coach now. Right. So how would you describe yourself as a coach? Very passionate, um, very, very competitive, um, and at times just wanting the best and for them on and off the court. Um, but I think for the biggest part, probably just competitive. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, that'll do it for the DSU Sports Safe this week. Join us next week. I'm Ben Bullock. This is Coach Keisha Killingsworth.